Hey guys, how you all doing? I'm Paul the Tech John and welcome to the channel. So today I have got some great news if you own a 2019 LG OLED TV because starting from today stroke yesterday, LG has started to roll out in over 40 countries an update which will add the Apple TV app to your TV. Yes, finally, the older generation TVs will start to get the Apple TV app. Now, initially, it is starting with the 2019 range. Um, like I said, all the OLEDs and also some of the Nanocell TVs, I think it is. Um, those model numbers, um, I'll just put them up on the screen, which are the series SM, 9x and SM8x and then um, later in the month I think they're going to be updating as well the UM7x and UM6x. Great news if you own a 2018 model LG OLED TV because we will also be getting the Apple TV update but unfortunately that won't be coming until later on in the year and we won't also see the addition of Apple AirPlay. That will only be for the 2019 models onwards. So what does this update allow you to do? Well, it will simply allow you to uh, play all of your movies that you may have um, purchased through iTunes or purchase additional films through um, the Apple TV app that uh, are in 4K, 4K HDR and Dolby Vision. So uh, you've got all the formats there to really show off uh, your LG OLED TV. Unfortunately, it would seem that um, it doesn't add Dolby Atmos sound. Um, I'd love for uh, to hear your feedback on that. And please, if you've got any films that you could try out that does normally have Dolby Atmos, I'd love for uh, someone to actually try that out and let me know if it does work or doesn't work as far as i know it won't work that you will need a proper dedicated 4k apple tv box for dolby atmos sound and it won't work through the actual app so uh, please let me know if it does or doesn't work another feature that it does allow you to use is the new apple tv plus service so again if you're into all that sort of stuff or the new apple tv series that they're uh, launching at the moment then uh, you'll be able to watch those all directly on your LG OLED TV, which is great. So apparently to get this update, you don't have to do anything. It should just appear in your menu bar on your LG TV. And uh, if any of you guys do find that you do have to do an update, please um, supply me with a firmware number so I can just update everyone else and keep everyone in the loop about um, what's going on with this app. It's all great stuff and it's, Really, really nice that LG has, uh, well, it seems like they have listened to their customers at long last. I think a bit of pressure maybe from Samsung because what they were doing, and it does make me wonder if LG would have done it, to be honest, if it wasn't for Samsung, but it doesn't matter. We are getting this update, and that is great. Just a shame that maybe some of the even older TVs, TVs maybe like the B, uh, the 7 series of uh, OLEDs couldn't have got it but still it's a good start and uh, yeah I look forward to hopefully getting it on uh, my B8 model and what I will be doing very soon is I will be comparing the um, Apple TV 4K box with the um, Apple AirPlay feature and the Apple TV app as well on my uh, Samsung TV and look at the differences what you can and can't do between AirPlay and the built-in app and the actual dedicated box should be interested to see you know like I say all the differences between them so there you have it then guys hopefully you enjoyed that video today and let's be honest what isn't there to like about a free update and if you did I would really appreciate a thumbs up and if you haven't already subscribed to the channel then maybe think about subscribing for more of the same in the future so thanks very much for joining me today and hopefully I'll catch you guys on the next one. Bye for now.